Marlene Rossi Severino Nobre, gynecologist specialized in cancer prevention. Since an early age, she was close to Francisco Cândido Xavier, who she regarded as a spiritual father. She always defended a humanitarian and holistic approach towards treatment. In 1967, she got together with like-minded colleagues to discuss how to bring in lay terms to the general public the role of spirituality in recovery and healthy living. This way, the first Medical Spiritist Association, AME, was founded in São Paulo in 1968. That was the beginning of her motto, to speak to medical colleagues about the spirit and how to treat patients in their entirety, as physical, emotional, and spiritual beings. Marlene continued to sponsor and support similar associations by promoting seminars, lectures, and meetings. In 1995, there were nine branches of AME across Brazil. In the same year, AME Brazil was founded to support and coordinate all activities in the country. In 1999, the association expanded to other countries such as Argentina, Colombia, Guatemala, Panama, Portugal, and Switzerland. That was the beginning of the International Medical Spiritist Association, AME International, which Marlene was also the president. In 2002, Marlene traveled for 30 days throughout Europe promoting seminars, lectures, and panel discussions reaching over 1,500 people. That gave birth to the first International Congress for Spirituality and Medicine. Since then, the event has taken place every year and has reached over 20 countries. Marlene was present in all of them herself, organizing, preparing, and also encouraging, motivating, and supporting the groups. By bringing medicine under spiritual perspective in panel discussions and scientific research studies, more and more medical colleagues started to embrace the cause. In the meantime, Marlene published several books, launched a magazine on health and spirituality, and held a weekly radio program called Medical Dialogue. She also managed the publication Spiritist News, founded in partnership with her late husband, Freitas Nobre. Marlene also ran an institution in Brazil to support children and families in need, providing primary and secondary education. In 2015, at 77 years of age, Marlene Nobre passed away. She left behind three children, many grandchildren, and the legacy of a life dedicated to her cause. In all these years, Marlene was able to bring to noble scholars and respected doctors the ability to scientifically study the patient beyond the physical realm a pioneering work in the science of the spirit. O que é importante, que sempre foi importante, é a alma imortal que habita o ser humano. 